Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Street Diaries. I am in the highly requested location of New York City. This is going to be an interesting one because New York is obviously massive, there's lots going on, so I think it's going to be split over a few episodes. I'm going to have to come back and shoot more of the city because I'm here for a limited amount of time. But today I'm shooting on the 5D Mark IV with the same lens from last episode which is the Canon 35 1.4 very excited i love shooting in new york so this is gonna be a fun episode let's get on with it street diaries new york let's do it so i'm starting out in the soho area i'm gonna shoot around here because it's kind of like a lot of fashion stuff going on here a lot of interesting people interesting looks fast paced kind of new york city vibe so first location is soho <laughs> Found the spot here with a nice colourful wall. Now waiting for the right person to walk past. Okay, finished in Soho. I think it was quite successful. And now we're heading to Central Park area to get some of those iconic shots of New York. I think it's going pretty well so far. Happy with some of the shots that I've kind of captured. But now let's head on to Central Park. Classic New York. Before Central Park, we've hit up Washington Square Park because Ai Weiwei has done an installation here. We thought we'd check it out first. This is what he's done. It's cool though because you can see behind here the Empire State Building right there just peeking through which is kind of a cool shot. The only problem is is that it's very busy so I think to get a good shot here you'd have to be like last thing at night or first thing in the morning. You'd have to get a little bit creative and try and think of an angle that doesn't involve like the whole sculpture itself which is cool I like a bit of a challenge. Okay guys, I've just taken a little seat in Washington Square Park, just reviewing some of the images. Today is challenging for sure, because I've only got a couple hours to shoot this. You know, obviously you want more time to kind of explore the city. So as I said at the start of this video, this is definitely just like a, a phase one of New York Street Diaries. I'm gonna have to come back and shoot it multiple times because there's so much going on. So we kind of hit up the Soho area, Washington Square Park, and then actually we're gonna go to like the Meatpacking District now, and I think I'm gonna finish there. But when I come back next time, I'm gonna hit up like Brooklyn and Williamsburg and Dumbo, that area. And and then I think I'm gonna do another one where it's more like Fifth Avenue, Central Park, like that. So that's how I'm gonna split it, I think. But I'm pretty happy with some of the shots I got. Hope you guys have enjoyed them. So yeah, let's uh, let's head over to the Meatpacking District. I think this has been great today, the, the Mark IV. Obviously last episode was Mark III. It's pretty much the same setup. Focusing is very quick, quick on this lens as well, which is good for street photography. I was thinking about using the 85 mil, but I went with the 35mm again just because I think it's such a good lens for street photography. Let's hit up the Meatpacking District. District? Let's hit up the Meatpacking District. Okay, I'm now in the Meatpacking District and I think this is where we're going to end it. I'm going to snap around here, hopefully get some more shots and call it a day because I've got to catch a flight. Definitely just lucked out by stumbling upon some kids playing basketball. I think that's definitely been my favorite shoot of the day. Um, 
they, they were hardcore as well. They were playing basketball in jeans. But yeah, I think that made for some good shots. So that was my favorite for sure. Okay, so that is the end of Street Diaries episode three in New York. Like I said, this is not over New York. It has been fun. Hope you guys like this episode. Obviously, New York was such a requested place to do a Street Diaries and I will be back for sure to hit up the kind of more touristy area like Fifth Avenue, Central Park, and then also kind of Brooklyn and Williamsburg. So New York is not over. I'm coming back to shoot another couple of videos here. If you guys have enjoyed this episode of Street Diaries, make sure you give it a thumbs up and comment down below which of your shots were the favorite or your favorite. And um, yeah, subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys soon for another video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Get in, 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 get in,